messed up, eh? Do you think uh, there's other things to eat other than animals? Yeah. Like yeah. what? Name a few. Vegetables. Wow. Vegetables, yeah. But we, you know we can get burgers, vegan burgers. Yeah. Do, you know, do you know what vegan means? Yeah. yeah. Don't, don't, eat meat, yeah. don't use animals at all. So we don't use them for their skin. We don't use them for their flesh. We don't test products on them. We don't wear their, wear their fur or anything like that, you know what I mean? Yeah. So we think that they deserve to be left alone, eh? What do you think about that? Do they get kept in these crates? These pigs? Farrowing crates? Oh, they die. Yeah, they stay, that's very common. This is, you know where this is all filmed? What do you think? China? What do you think? Someone have a guess. Where? America. Australia. It's all Australian footage, okay? Australian farms and abattoirs. You know what an abattoir is? It's a fancy French name for a slaughterhouse. They're just dead piglets, they just die, they, they might get squashed by their mum or... If you can eat something else, would you choose something else? Yeah. You know, have you been to Lord of the Fries? Lord of the Fries? Oh, what the hell? They got all vegan burgers there, man. Killer stuff. Look at that. Here, someone take this card. Sign up. This is Challenge 22, right? You got Facebook? Who's got Facebook? Yeah. You've all got Facebook? Yeah. They will, you can sign up for a challenge, man. 22 days and they, it's all free. They just help you. You say, oh, well, I want to go vegan, but what do I eat? And they will help you, man. It's killer, bro. You don't have to eat like dead bodies of animals that have like lived like that, eh? Wait, who's gonna do challenge 22? One? How many? Three? Four challenge 22. All right. <laughs>live without using animals and anytime you're using animals there's some kind of cruelty animal has to lose their life they're treated as a slave or as a product as an object yeah and we think that they uh, deserve their own moral treatment and their own right to a life of freedom like we all we all want you know we don't want to be hurt abused treated as nothing turned into a pair of shoes a burger when we have um Thousands of alternatives now. Veganism is so easy now. We've got burgers, cheese, ice cream, milks. If you go into a supermarket, there's 20 different milks to choose from. But we still want the one that was stolen from a dead baby cow. You know, because they kill all the cows and calves in the... Someone was saying even milk. The way they milk the cow, the way they keep the cow, and the way they keep having the mother cow. Pregnant, the and they pregnant take the baby. Babies, yes. so even milk. I've been in a dairy farm. It's a... Right? A sad, yes. depressing. They separate the yeah. families. Yeah. They kill all the the bobby calves. Yeah. All get killed because they can't produce milk. So That's they right. kill. They keep making the mother calves pregnant. And the way they do it is they 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 have a, a bull that they harvest his semen from, and then they artificially they stick a, their fist inside her ass. So first they get forcibly impregnated. They stick a fist up their ass, and they stick a tube of semen in them, and they get them pregnant, right? Then when they have their baby, yeah. they take the babies away from all the cows. Yeah. Do you know why? Ah, uh, right. They're killing the, the cows or selling them? Well, they want to take the babies away because they'll drink all our milk. Yeah. And then they artificially inseminate her. And when she has a baby, they take all their milk, take a baby away. If it's a boy, they kill the boy. If it's a girl, they have to produce milk too. Do you know what happens to the cows when they don't produce milk anymore? They kill them. With a special meat, it's a uh, baby because meat. Veal. What? Veal? Veal. What veal. Like veal. And, uh, but why do you think uh, veal exists? There's another industry. Because... Uh, There's another industry. So they don't want the babies drinking their own mit, mother's yeah, what, milk. What are, we, what are they giving to the babies then? They give them a formula. Oh, so slush. Yeah. They, they separate them, put them in ice uh, in confinement. In right. separate, they separate them from the mother. Kill the females too. After six years of having the milk sucked out of them, their baby's stolen from them continuously. All right? When they can't produce milk and they collapse, they kill them. Dairy industry. Do you know what dairy is? 
No. So it's milk from the breast of a cow. Okay. Okay. So in order for the cow to produce milk, she has yeah. to be what? She has to be pregnant, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, she has to have a baby. Yeah. Yeah, so what do they do with them babies? But when they, when they can't produce milk anymore, you know what happens to them? Yeah. They get shot in the head and have their head cut off and they're chopped up into pieces and fed to us as burgers. Oh, really? Yeah. Do you think that's worth a glass of milk? What about for chocolate? Look at this chocolate here. It's got no milk in it. No cow's milk. We've got almond milk, rice milk, soy milk. Heaps of other different milks, man. Heaps of other different cheeses. No need to do that to the, their families, you know? Well, the boys don't produce milk, do they? Yeah. Yeah, so they Only kill. girls can. Only girls can produce milk. Yeah. It's like uh, the baby, uh, baby chicken. Yeah. The males can't produce eggs. So what do they do with the males? Yeah. yeah. They kill them, yeah? yeah. Every single animal product, um, these animals suffer and die for. I mean, many people won't do anything, but everything's government regulated. Like, you know, yeah, but what, if we have enough people that don't support it, that don't buy animal products, and then we start a movement, we can start lobbying for government too. Oh, so you're so, still like on the heavy face. But if we're all still paying for me, yeah. why are they going to stop? They're yeah, getting money like, from yeah. you, bro. Yeah. They're, they're getting money to stab these animals to death. There's no cruelty-free way, way of mass-producing animals. And even if there was, even if there was some utopian, humane way of doing this, at the end of the day, they all get their heads chopped off in the slaughterhouse, that all of them, every single animal will have their throat slit. They have a bolt gun first, maybe, they might get electrocuted first, or they might be put in a gas chamber first. Um, but all of them have their heads chopped off. And we just think it's just uh, not necessary. Even for wool, like wool in clothes, they're cutting sheep's heads off for that. At the end, when they can't produce wool anymore, um, so once they they can't they stop being as productive they kill them all. So we just think it's unnecessary. We've got cotton, we have dairy-free uh, cheese, chocolate, milk. Because we've done it for a long time, does that mean we should keep doing it? Yeah. Does that mean we should keep doing it? We've done lots of bad things for a long time. Yeah. Yes, but it's uh, you know tradition. Tradition. Yeah. Yeah. It's on the people's mind. Yeah. What about your mind? Don't worry about everyone else. You, as an individual, do you think you need to contribute to it by buying burgers and... No. you need it for your health? Do you think you need milk and meat for your health? Milk cow is not good for human people. Cow's milk is not good for human people, no? I don't, I don't like milk, yeah. but I love meat. You love meat? Meat, meat, yeah, yeah. flesh, yeah. flesh of an animal. Yeah, I used to love it too. Mum is a vegetarian, so. <laughs> we advocate for veganism because vegetarians obviously just don't eat meat, which is just yeah. one aspect of yeah. animal use and abuse. And uh, my grandfather, both grandfather, grew, grew cows. Yeah. What about this meat here? Is it's that where your grandfather a, grew this meat too? No, it's McDonald's. Just, it's just the water. Oh, it's just water. You don't yeah. eat from McDonald's. No, no, no food. No. Okay. Only water and uh, ice cream. So when you um, oh, the ice cream come from the cow and the cow calves get killed. We do this challenge. We got heaps of info here about health and environment. But this is a, a vegan challenge. 22 days and they it's all free on Facebook. And they they, they do this mentoring program and you do it with a bunch of people and like yeah they will tell you where to get this vegan burger, where to get this vegan milk and. They help you through the process and they educate you as well if you've got any questions about protein, iron, calcium. And then challenge 22. That's what I'd do. Best speech you'll ever hear. Yeah. Gary Yorofsky, he's hectic, he's mad. He better deliver. He better deliver, oh, mate, he will. Like, if we can be healthy without doing this to animals, yeah. you know, we, we can eat them, we don't need them to survive. Yes, but We're basically doing it for some other reason. Yeah. Like, that's not necessary. Yes. Like, if we can get burgers and cheese and milk from plants, why are we doing this to these animals? It's not the same taste. It's not the same, so we're doing it for taste. Do you think, um, because a bean tastes good, it justifies doing this to them? Like, do, it, it makes it okay. If they, if they taste good, it's okay to hurt them? No, no, no. Yeah. I can't, I can't say that when I saw this. <laughs> exactly. On the back here, you can sign up for Facebook, man. It's for free, it's Challenge 22, you do it for 22 days. But what about what meat do you eat when you're in Australia? In Australia, I... From the supermarket? Yeah, chicken and... Uh, 
terrifying. Kangaroo? Yeah. Kangaroos? You eat kangaroos? Yeah. Do you think that's weird or? No, no. It's like this. One of the guys who had the boy up and had the things feeling. It's killer, bro. It's a good decision. I don't want to do that to animals, man, eh? Hey? They're, like, they're like puppies. Have you met cows before? Yeah. They're like puppies, man. They're like little dogs. Cute. Hell cute, intelligent. They know it's they're so. I've, I've been in a dairy farm, they're all crying, man. They're all crying, they're sad. I've been out the front of slaughterhouses and they're on trucks about to go to slaughter and they're tearing out their eyes. And I've been to a sanctuary yesterday and I said to her, do any of your cows cry? And she goes, no. My, my grandfather respects this animal. Yes, yes. Uh, this guy doesn't have kids, so therefore he doesn't realize that, you know, you're not, you can't choose the way you're born. Yes, narrow-minded bastard. Uh, that guy's saying um, no to gay marriage, and I think those two guys were gay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. He's against uh, equality, that man. Okay. Yeah, but the, the, the gay man wasn't happy with it. But we're for we're actually for equality for like humans and animals. We think we deserve equal treatment, like yeah. a life without slavery, suffering, a bolt gun in the head, a knife across the throat. We don't think um, respecting animals is killing them and eating them. Yes. We don't think that that's respect. We think respect is to treat um, animals with compassion, kindness, let them live their life and eat something else. But, but we, lived in we live in Asia. Oh, even better, even easier. No, it's so hard. I find it so hard. Whereabouts in Asia? Vegan. Thailand. Oh my God, Thailand's the vegan mecca. Ginjay. Ginjay in but Thailand. Jay is not. Jay, yeah. Jay is vegan. Oh. Ginjay is uh, vegan. No, right. no animal products. And if you see the G in the, the yellow, uh, yellow and red sign, right, right, G right, in the right, J, right. Yeah. yeah, that's uh, vegan in Thailand. So good in Thailand for vegan stuff. Every people said you have to eat some meat, you have to eat some fish. Same. You have to drink some milk. Same here. And yeah. yeah. Me too. Yes. I was brought up the same. Italian meat, meat, pasta uh, with cheese on top, a dairy, a bacon for breakfast, eggs, everything, man. But I woke up. Just because people think it's okay and, and they're, they're used to it doesn't make it right. I missed you too. A lot of the time, everyone, they don't know what they're talking about. My yeah. parents, they don't know what they're talking about. They don't know what, they haven't seen this. People haven't seen this. I have now. I've seen it all. It's horrible. Disgusting. Yeah, really? Yeah. And this is... I think it's really... And they won't stop? But... People won't stop raping and killing each other either, but that doesn't mean I have to contribute to it. Just because everyone's going to kill each other in war, shoot each other, that won't, that will never stop. Yeah? Yeah. Does that mean you should go around killing people? No, I can't. Yeah. Maybe animals won't ever stop being killed, but you can stop killing them for your burger in, um, or your chicken, you know what I mean? You can stop. That's how we create peace in our own lives.